on December 26, 2024, local residents near Chengdu, Sichuan, captured video footage of a tailless aircraft conducting a test flight. Bearing the serial number 36011, this enigmatic jet has ignited global speculation, embodying the hallmarks of a sixth-generation fighter. Known as the Chengdu J-36, this aircraft represents a monumental leap in China's military aviation ambitions, challenging established competitors and signaling the country's intent to redefine modern air combat. The J-36 is distinguished by its radical tailless delta wing design, a bold departure from traditional fighter configurations. This layout eliminates vertical stabilizers, reducing radar cross-section and enhancing stealth. Advanced fly-by-wire systems replace conventional stability mechanisms, ensuring precision control while improving drag efficiency. The design is optimized for long-range missions and high-speed engagements, delivering both operational flexibility and tactical superiority. A unique feature of the J-36 is its tri-engine configuration, with air intakes positioned on the fuselage and sides. Reportedly powered by cutting-edge ACE engines, this setup offers increased thrust and enhanced reliability. Capable of reaching Mach 2.5, the J-36 is poised for air superiority and strike missions, rivaling the capabilities of Western contemporaries. Its three-engine system also supports heavier payloads and extended range, emphasizing operational sustainability in contested environments. The aircraft's dimensions reflect its versatile role, measuring 22.5 meters in length with a wingspan of 24 meters. Its internal volume allows for advanced avionics and robust weapon systems, supported by a maximum takeoff weight of 55 tons. Uh, an estimated combat radius of 3,000 kilometers underscores its strategic importance in regions like the Indo-Pacific, where extended reach is critical for power projection. The J-36's innovative features signal a broader evolution in China's approach to air combat. Its tailless design is not merely an aesthetic choice, but a calculated move to achieve enhanced stealth and aerodynamic efficiency. By reducing the radar cross-section, the J-36 can penetrate advanced air defense systems, such as the US-made Patriot or the Russian S-400. Additionally, the absence of tailplanes minimizes drag, improving fuel efficiency, and extending operational range. Critical for missions in the Indo-Pacific, where vast distances between theaters of operation constrain logistical capabilities. The advanced propulsion system further cements the J-36's status as a technological marvel. Reports suggest that the tri-engine configuration utilizes next-generation WS-19 engines, a product of years of research into thrust vectoring and fuel-efficient propulsion. These engines are believed to integrate supercruise capabilities, allowing the aircraft to maintain supersonic speeds without afterburners. This feature is crucial for reducing infrared visibility and prolonging engine life during sustained operations. Stealth capabilities of the J-36 extend beyond its shape. The aircraft reportedly employs cutting-edge radar-absorbing materials that diminish radar detection ranges even further. Combined with the use of advanced coatings and electronic warfare countermeasures, the J-36 can operate effectively in environments where adversaries rely heavily on detection and tracking technologies. This stealth-centric approach aligns with China's broader strategic objectives of anti-access area denial, A2AD, particularly in contested regions like the South China Sea. The avionics and sensor suite on board the J-36 are equally groundbreaking. Its AESA radar system is designed to provide unparalleled situational awareness, capable of detecting and tracking multiple targets over extended distances. This capability is critical for engaging modern threats, including stealth aircraft and hypersonic weapons. Furthermore, the integration of electro-optical targeting systems, EOTS, enhances precision in target acquisition and engagement, making the J-36 a formidable adversary in both air-to-air -air and air-to-ground combat scenarios. The avionics are expected to be supplemented by advanced artificial intelligence systems, enabling autonomous decision-making and enhancing pilot situational awareness, 
in complex combat environments. The J-36's weapon systems are tailored for versatility, allowing it to perform a wide range of missions with precision and effectiveness. Internal weapons bays ensure that the aircraft maintains its stealth profile while carrying an impressive payload. The loadout is expected to include the PL-15 and PL-17 missiles form the backbone of the J-36's air superiority arsenal. The PL-15, with its extended range and active radar guidance, is designed to counter high-value enemy assets such as AWACS and tanker aircraft. Meanwhile, the PL-17, equipped with advanced seekers, targets stealth aircraft and long-range bombers, ensuring dominance in the aerial domain. The YJ-12 supersonic anti-ship missiles highlight the J-36's maritime strike capabilities. These weapons are engineered for high-speed engagements against heavily defended naval assets, complementing China's broader strategy of deterring U.S. carrier strike groups in the Pacific. Additionally, precision-guided munitions, such as satellite-guided bombs and anti-radiation missiles, enable the J-36 to neutralize ground-based air defense systems and critical infrastructure. Uh, speculation abounds regarding the J-36's potential to carry hypersonic weapons. These high-speed munitions would provide a strategic advantage in engaging time-sensitive sensitive targets and penetrating advanced defense networks. In the race to develop sixth-generation fighters, the J-36 stands alongside notable programs such as the U.S. NGAD and the European FCAS. While the NGAD emphasizes modularity and networked warfare, leveraging unmanned systems and advanced AI, the FCAS focuses on a systems-of-systems approach, integrating manned fighters with swarms of drones. The J-36, on the other hand, prioritizes stealth, range, and payload versatility, aligning with China's strategic emphasis on power projection and A2AD. Compared to the US F-35, the J-36 offers a larger airframe, potentially enabling it to carry more fuel and weapons. Its tri-engine configuration may provide greater redundancy and operational flexibility, though it also introduces complexity in maintenance and logistics. Against the F-22, the J-36's emphasis on range and multi-role adaptability offers a more versatile platform, while its stealth features aim to rival the Raptor's dominance in air superiority. The development timelines also highlight the J-36's strategic importance. While Western programs benefit from decades of research and development, the rapid pace of the J-36's evolution demonstrates China's commitment to closing the technological gap. By leveraging lessons learned from earlier projects like the J-20 and J-31, China has accelerated the J-36's progress, positioning it as a competitor in the global arena. The J-36's emergence has far-reaching implications for China's military doctrine and regional security dynamics. As a multi-role platform with extended range and stealth capabilities, the J-36 is ideally suited for operations in the Indo-Pacific, where contested airspace and vast distances demand both endurance and survivability. Its ability to engage high-value targets, neutralize advanced air defenses, and conduct maritime strike missions aligns with China's broader strategic objectives of securing its territorial claims and deterring adversaries. The aircraft's capabilities also enhance China's power projection beyond regional theaters. With a combat radius of 3,000 kilometers, the J-36 can conduct missions deep into enemy territory, supporting joint op operations, and extending China's influence in critical areas such as the Indian Ocean and the Middle East. This expanded reach underscores the shift in China's military doctrine from territorial defense to global operations, reflecting its aspirations as a rising superpower.